Hi again. <clears throat> Today I'm uh, going to try to construct a conductive plastic electrode. The other electrodes are a bit flimsy and they take three and a half hours to make. I'm trying to cut down on the time it takes and plus it's a pretty messy job. It's pretty dusty. And um, this is the little mould I've made up so far. It's a three piece. It's got a lid here and a base and a little outer which governs the um, height of the electrode and the thickness. And it's got a compression plate which you put over the top and compress the whole thing. So far my tests um, have failed. All my um, plastic sort of come out brittle, as you can see there. The ohms aren't too bad. This is um, the last mix I made up. I've got the alligator clip connected to it. It's um, sort of dried and crusty. It's actually better on the spoon than it was just floating around by itself. And um, we've got it on the 200 ohms. It's not too bad for just a sort of, it's pretty crusty. But if I can get this with one hand. Okay, 14 ohms. Uh, you might say it's that, we'll put it on the wood. Could have been that. <clears throat> but, uh, go. All right, yeah. Fourteen ohms. Not too bad. I think I can get it down to ten. If I can get it to ten, I'll be um happy with that because my sheets are only about ten. So there you go, I'll keep you updated on that one. I haven't yet got the material to make that a cell yet. I'm working on making some material. Okay, I'll get back when I've um, constructed something. 